All right, parents, you know it is tough to get some kids to eat healthy foods. It helps, though, if you get them involved in the cooking. Health and yoga expert Rainbow Mars has a new book. It's called The 21 Day Superstar Cleanse. Rainbow's here with us. She brought her along her daughter, Jade. We're going to talk about how to get the kids involved in the kitchen and get them eating some of that good stuff. Yes, Yay. it's all about, <laughs> you know, doing it with the kids so that it's fun. If they try, if they have a hand in it, they're going to try it. So yeah. you like to cook? I love to cook. All right. Yes. Jade loves mm -hmm. to cook. All right. What are we making, so Rainbow? The, right now we have some chia seed pudding that's a great thing for kids, really all of us to be eating. It's got omega-3, 6s. It's high in protein. It's good for the brain, so for school. And what I just I did was soak two teaspoons in about 16 ounces of water, and it became like an oatmeal. And what you would do with that is just add a little bit of maple syrup. Okay. Um, Give it a little sweetness. Yeah, a little bit of maple syrup Maybe and some, some blueberries. blueberries. And then I have you know, coconut oil here to show. I'll just put them all in. <laughs> I'm not gonna do the maple syrup just now because, and then coconut oil just to give them extra fat and health for their joints. Okay, so and, you, and you like this, Jade? Yeah. Does it taste good to you? Yeah. It That's not like chocolate like pudding, but good enough. It's right? even oatmeal. <laughs> like, it's actually delicious. Okay, like, so I've you can have it for breakfast? Yeah, it's a great food for breakfast. And I had every child that has come to our house, it's a win win. Like, right. there's if never an 11 year old likes it, I bet we'd like it too. You yeah. will love it. Yeah, it's a great thing. You actually feel better about serving them that than a, like some French toast before school. So mm -hmm. do the chia, although she loves French toast. Then Next we have up. a kale salad, which we kind of just were showing the easiness. Jade, do you want to, do you want to tear one of us, one sure. of these with us? Oh, sure. Kale? So we just de-stemmed it, and we're just—we're okay. not even using a knife here. We're just cutting it into little bite-sized parts. So have a little kale chopped salad. Yes, and then so while you do that, JD, how about you put, squeeze the lemon? And actually, I'll squeeze the lemon. Okay, I'll <laughs> keep tearing. And then JD, do you want to do the olive oil? Sure. And so it's literally—it's not about eating foods that don't have fat. You always need fat, salt, and sweet, or. Um, yeah, fat, salt, and sweet, or sour. This kind this. of cooks things, so the lemon actually cooks the food as if, um, is this not already open? <laughs> as if, no, it is open. It cooks the food just like as if you were making ceviche. So you want to put liberal amounts of those. If you stop, if you get into healthy living and then you stop using salt, you're going to be like, okay, hey, this food is boring. So it's all about those three elements, and it makes it all taste good. So I have Himalayan salt, which means that the vitamins and minerals are actually in the salt. So you're it getting all pink. the nutrients you yeah. need. Yeah, it's pretty. Yes, Pink it's beautiful. And, <laughs> and then do the avocado and then go. You're going to show them how you can do it so effortlessly. The thing about all this food is that it's effortless, it's easy, you can do it at home, your kids can make it. Oh, and you get to squish your fingers in the yeah. avocado, yeah. right? Of course you want clean hands, but go for it. You want a deep tissue, the, the, the salad. So the book has tons of easy, guilt-free recipes. It's all about eating as much as you want, zero yeah. calorie restriction, eating as much of these foods as you want. And you break the, um, the kind of jumpstart plan into 21 days, and each day you outline exactly what they should be doing in the yeah. book. Yeah, and, and it's not about like a preachy thing. It's really like an hour-by-hour hour guide so that you have, you're feeling like in a slump and you want to have a healthy day. You just pick up the book. Just have the book by your bedside, have it in your house so you continue to get inspired by whether it's recipes with Jade and I or um, you know, poetry, or little daily toolkits, or affirmations. So it's not just of the about day. what you're eating; it's about what no. you're doing for yeah. yourself fitness. to feed your soul, right? Exactly, like little good fitness tips. So anyway, so you could also slice up a tomato, but we already have that pre-done. So you might want to yeah. try if you want to, just like I a little piece. I would love to, Jade. You're going to need a shower. Of after how this. simple uh -huh. yeah. that made something actually taste delicious. It really is. Do good. you love it? Okay, mm. I love kale anyway, so <laughs> can't go wrong there. What's okay. the favorite thing? Uh, your favorite thing that your mom makes? Um. Well, I think the kale salads are also really, really good, and um, I love the gluten-free pasta. Mm. And vegan pizza vegan is pizza. a favorite. Yeah, so yeah. these foods, if you get them involved, Jade actually loves making smoothies. We wanted to do a superfood beauty smoothie. All the things in nature, whatever it looks like is usually good for that. So we actually pre-cut the seeds. seeds. That's what the seeds look like. She <laughs> thinks they look weird, but so we have them out. You want to show? <laughs> okay, so we have a papaya that is really good for digestion. It's also really good for the skin. My mom would actually take the skin of this after she made the smoothie. Ooh, I'm splashing everywhere. <laughs> Whoa! And put it on her face. So for like an enzyme the peel. The skin of the yeah, papaya. Yeah, the skin of the papaya. You can actually use most fruit. fruits, except for um, mango you would not want to use. Okay. But that's a much cheaper than what's <laughs> in most bottles at your store. And Jade's actually ready to go effective. with something else. What's that? Okay, yes. go ahead. These are goji berries. Goji berries. They're delicious and 
Okay, awesome. we're going to dump They're those in there. They're one of the highest. We're going to do a fourth of a cup. This this recipe is in the they book. They sound like Rice Krispies. <laughs> yeah, they're a little de dehydrated. They're also actually good for the kidneys. Really high in antioxidants. Good rate for your skin. I'm going to put three strawberries, which are high in vitamin C, and good for the heart. They look like the heart. Handful of raspberries. <laughs> put them in there. And um, some blackberries as well, which here, go ahead, put the, put the raspberries okay, on. Okay, so papaya, strawberries, raspberries, blackberries. So we have all the superfoods that we need. And goji berries. And this, the surprise here is going to be a cucumber, which cucumber, if it looks like the skin, like it looks like um, a skin cell, and it's very good and high in silica and good for our skin. Surprising, you won't even taste it, so I'm and just going to cut gonna it. put some lemonade in here, too. Now the okay. book, you can use fresh sweets, almond milk, hemp. Um, actually, we don't use a lot of hemp, but you could do almond milk. That's but lemonade, we're doing, huh? Mm -hmm. We love lemons. They're also really good for your liver. Okay, lemons. so you're just going to put the top on. We're going to mix that all up. Yes. And what do you call this? This is called your Superfood Beauty Smoothie. I love it. Oh, wait. <laughs> Let's see if it's all the way on and down. <laughs> There we looks go. fabulous. So six or seven ingredients, pour that in a cup, and we're going to have a drink. Mm -hmm. All right. And Jade and Rainbow, thank you <laughs> so much. Uh, again, for more information about Rainbow Mars and her recipes in her new book, just go to kcal9.com, <laughs> click Scene on TV. Thank you.